Hello, welcome back. Meat Boy, Josh, Artie, saw blades, walls, collapsing. Ah! There's the play-by-play. -play. All right, uh, he lines up the jump and he he gets to the wall so it what crumbles away and the saw blade hits him. I actually didn't mean to do that. All right, the wall, the wall crumbles away. He avoids the saw blade, wall crumbles. He's doing ah, a fuck you. little back and forth jumping as he slides up the wall. Still avoiding that saw blade. Although he didn't avoid that one. I guess you really got <laughs> I don't think this is the first time you've done this on me. I just ran right into it. I don't think that's the first time you've done it on me, boy. The play by play? Yeah. I think it is. I think I've picked on you like by saying things in a play by play way yes, back. Yes, yes! But never in the Oh god, look at those rockets. Ah are those the seeking ones too? I think they are. Yeah, they are. Mm. I'm standing up right now, so my penis is like right in the mic. Good. Can you hear me coming? <laughs> oh my god. My throat hurts, my stomach hurts, I'm dying, man. It's because of all the dick you suck. Uh, I know, I gotta cut it back. Casey, stop letting me suck your dick so much. Ah, fuck. She laughed. I timed that wrong. Casey's sitting on the side sending us funny pictures between takes. <laughs> and making us talk about the American healthcare system. Yeah. What a jerk. Uh, How did I fucking die, dude? Dude, I don't know. Oh my uh, god, why are you so gassy? Why did I burp you? Dude, I feel, I'm just, I feel mentally and physically defeated by Taco Bell. Like, they just destroyed me. How did you feel any better? I feel that way about many things. Many things? Many. M-A-N-Y. Who's Benny? Somebody I should know about? Benny Banassi? I'm cheating on you with Benny. We do other YouTube videos together. I knew it! <laughs> I knew it! I hear a sound. Uh, My parents are home. Yay! Good. Yeah, Casey, go greet them. Go greet them and tell them we're doing things. <laughs> Be Shout quiet. out to Kathy and George Barclay for uh, coming home while we're recording. <laughs> Thanks for coming home, Dad. Appreciate it. Thought I was going to end up with like, one of those wayward children. I am a wayward children. Wayward children. I am multiple children. I am. You are not. Ah! Josh, why? I'm not even yelling cuss words anymore. I'm yelling in general. Just noises. <laughs> Just yelling. Oh my god. Oh my god. I'm never going to beat this game. Watching this has become a chore now. Like, I actually watched... I, Fuck you. Watching this at the beginning was fun, because it was like, oh, you missed it. And then you got it the next time. I was you like, yeah. You can leave whenever you want. But now... No, I can't. I need content, man. You can go. I need content. I can record this on my own. <laughs> God, that would be boring. Are you calling me boring? No, I just... I don't know. I, I, I don't... I personally don't think that... You have to be extremely charismatic to freaking have a one-person Let's Play channel. Uh, I know some good one-person Let's Play channels. No, I do too. I'm I mean, not like, good enough for that. No, I mean Markiplier. No. Markiplier's good at what he, he's yeah. good at doing it. I mean, yeah, Markiplier did that. What's that? So I forgot Markiplier. Yeah, did that. and I mean, like, he's he's good at it. He does it really well. But I know I couldn't. I am not interesting enough to do. It. I need somebody else to bounce things off of. I got you, fam. Yeah, like, we, we need that. Without that, we just... It would just be me playing a video game angrily. Yeah, well, that was me playing this game. First time I played this game, played a lot <laughs> of it alone. And I was just stewing. People would, like, talk to me after I'd been playing this game for a couple hours. I'd be like, what do you want? Oh, God. Oh. <laughs> I can hear the dog upstairs because he's getting pet in the right place. Oh, oh I'm sorry, Josh. Did you fart? I'm sorry. Oh my god. I'm sorry, Josh. Isn't that bad? I'm sorry, Josh. Did you poop? No. I didn't shit myself. Well, I might have. There was a delay. No. I just wasn't sure. It was silent. That's why I didn't know. You know, I got one of those SBDs. Silent but deadly. Oh, man. That T-Bell. Yeah, T-Bell fucks with you, man. It's because I ate too much of it. That's the problem. Yeah, it's... you all, you all like, oh, you ate so fast. I only got three things from T-Bell. Fuck you. Well, technically, I did too. Well, yeah, but. But that's, but that's. There's a big size difference between us, me and you. Yeah, three things for you is nothing. Three things for me is too much. But I don't like wasting food, so I ate it. Could have eaten it later. Well, it's Taco Bell. It's really Taco. You can't, you can't save Taco Bell for later, and you know it. Taco Bell gets icky fast. Yeah, exactly. 
Just get soggy. Oh, jo wow, you just took that right in the mouth. You just opened up and you're like, put it in. It aroused me. Mm. Yeah, they're kind of phallic, aren't they? The, the missiles. No! It's a rocket ship! <laughs> That's from that thing you were telling me about. Uh, yeah, Death to Smoochie. I've never, I'd never heard of it until now. I'm, I'm telling you, man, we'll have to watch it. It's so good. It's wicked funny. You, that's implying we hang out outside of this. Uh, oh, yeah, I forgot. We're Penn and Teller. Yeah, <laughs> we gotta keep the illusion alive. Just like they do in their magic. Haha! <laughs> that was it, funny, Artie. I brought it all back. Bring it all back. Wow, Josh. <sighs> this game gives me cancer. I'm gonna have to go sell meth to go get rid of it. Uh, or move to Canada. Or move to Canada. And show's over. We were also talking about that, how um, there was like this... When Breaking Bad first started, there was this thing about how um, like basically it was a meme and it was like if Breaking Bad took place in Canada and it was just uh, it was like, Walter, you have cancer. You start treatment Monday. Your health coverage covers it all. <laughs> and it was like, the end. It's like, ugh. Oh, God bless. Oh, whew. Wow. That was badass. Wow. Tell me that was a badass. That was that was pretty cool, man. Man. No. Man. Oh. Oh. Baby. Oh. Baby, baby, baby. Oh. Josh. Oh. Oh. Yeah. Hey, hey, you got an A plus, boy. Woo. Oh, right there. High five. Yeah. Yeah. Woohoo. <sighs> wow. I felt All that. the meatballs. I felt that in my balls. Holy crap. Holy fuck. I'm surprised you got an A plus on that. Nah, I'm good. Ah, damn it. <laughs> got cocky. That's what happens when you get cocky. Whoop. Fuck. <laughs> Dude, that guy just straight up eats you. I love like, this thing. It's an animation. Yeah, he's like just... Arr, arr. It's just one bite, too. He's like... Arr. Dude, I don't know how to get rid of him. I got rid of him once. I don't... I think they have to hit the bottom. I think if they hit the uh, oh, great. the little guys, they die. <laughs> There's two of them then. Uh, either that or freaking the bleed. Can we talk about how like everyone in the world's dead? Like you could see the skeletons of people. Yeah. Because the rapture happened. Yeah. And all that's left is you and a fetus. Yeah. It sounds like uh. But look at it this way. At least, ah! At least sounds, they went to heaven. It sounds like the plot of um. I am Legend. No. Oh. <laughs> I would watch that. I am. I liked I am Legend. Most people would like trash on it, dude. I love that movie. Oh, that was alright. Um, when he had to shoot the dog, dude. Children of Men, by the way, was the movie I was thinking Children of. Children of Men. Sounds Which, familiar. All that's left is you and a fetus. That's like one of my favorite post-apocalyptic movies because it's interesting. It's a different take. Instead of like a zombie apocalypse or yeah. like a vampire apocalypse like in Children of Men. Yeah. Not Children of Men. I am Legend. In Children of Men, what happens is that babies stop being born. Oh, okay. And then this guy finds a woman who's pregnant, and he has to go save her. Interesting. You know what? I, I even though I haven't gotten a chance to read it yet, there's um there's a comic called um Why the Last Man, and essentially he's literally the last man on Earth. Like there's women and shit, but he is the only. No. Josh, he's the only man, and uh, I haven't read the comic, but I feel like that would make a great movie. I would watch the shit out of that. I, I love apocalyptic movies. Like Book of Eli? Book of Eli's dope. That's a good movie. I like that movie. I, I thought liked... that was... I, the, the the way they twist it and everything at the end, I mean, I, obviously I'm not going to do any spoilers, but that's a good... Like... Well, I liked the part in that movie where they, like, he went to go buy something, and they're like, first, let me see your hands. And then you find out later, in the, and, like, so the guy, Eli, holds out his hands, um, and he goes, all right, you're good. And you find out later why he had him hold out the hands. Yeah. Which is uh, due to cannibals. That's not really spoiling anything. No. But, because I explain it, but it's due, like, if you are a cannibal, you end up... Because this is actually true. If you're a cannibal, you are getting more of a certain kind of protein than you should be. Because yes, the human yes. body can't process that protein in the brain. Yes, correct. Uh, and because of that, you start to lose motor function, and you'll start to shake. Yeah. Go! Oh! Oh, this shit. What? Oh, 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 oh,
Josh. I'm not going to be able to beat that other part again. Oh, Josh. Oh, I'm going to be able to beat this part again eventually. Not right now. But I will not be able to beat that other part again. That was pure luck. Dude, you... Oh, my God. That was like MLG Pro right there, dude. <laughs> hey, at least I beat more than one episode... <laughs> one level this episode. Did you? Yeah. Oh, yeah. You said... I was happy about something and you just don't care. Dude, I just don't, I don't remember anything anymore. They're all blending together. Well, it's because they're all gray and red. What? Oh, uh, yeah. <laughs> Every episode looks exactly the same to me right now. Fuck. Oh. Basically, it's gray, it's red. I'm dying. I'm yelling. Meatballs. Artie's talking about current events. Donald Trump, that's a guy. <laughs> no. <laughs> <laughs> last time we last time we tried to do that on a video, we had Janice here, and uh, she thought we were actually going to start talking about politics. Yeah, she's she getting got, all kinds of salty. I was like, whoa, 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 whoa. She got, like, really nervous and was like, I want to talk about this. And we were like, no, we're not going to talk about Donald joke. Trump on the internet. I don't know shit. What a fucking awful idea. I am not a, poli poli a politic. I'm not a political man. I am, but we play video games on the internet. I shouldn't have my political opinions nah, on it. No, it's irrelevant. It's irrelevant to what we're doing. Yeah, no, I'm only I... saying that because I want to vote for George W. Bush. I know what I said. <laughs> I want him to run for president again. I want to vote for Nixon. Richard Nixon. I am not a crook. So every time I hear Richard Nixon, I don't think of the things that... Well, besides the obvious historical figure. Um, in pop culture, my favorite interpretation of Richard Nixon is in the Nazi Zombies 5 map. I never actually saw that. So in it, you play as JFK, um, John McNamara. Um, oh, is that the one that doesn't it take place in like the Pentagon? Oh, maybe I have played that map then. But the uh, Richard Nixon and uh, Fidel Castro, Fidel Castro, not Fidel. It's a character from Dragon Ball Z. <laughs> <laughs> Fidel Castro, um, and it's really funny. But Richard Nixon just runs around going, "Oh, I am terrified of this. Oh my goodness!" I never got to play as him. I'm sad. Hey, guess what? Still on that game and an Xbox 360. Oh! Someday! So do I. I have an Xbox 360 and an Xbox... We've got every console. You're going to get so much content from us, guys. You don't even know. We do have every console, don't we? You don't even know! Between the three of us. Pretty much, yeah. All we are oh. missing is, like, an NES. Sega and, like... Does one of us have an NES? No, nah, I don't have an NES. I don't either. I got an Atari Casey Flashback. Might. Casey, my You have an Atari Flashback? Yeah, dude. Oh, my God. That's fucking so awesome. So we all kinds of old school games that there, too. That is fucking awesome. Yeah. No, all we're, all we're missing is a NES and a Sega. Somebody want to send us a Sega? Go for it. I'll take it. Or a NES. Yeah, or a NES. Actually, I have a friend. Uh, his name's Matt. Shout out to my buddy Matt, who I haven't seen in a couple years. Or well, I have, but I just haven't seen him regularly. We uh, hung out a lot when I was a sophomore. Uh, he is was a senior. Uh, but he keeps an NES in the back of his car. Ah, oh, my boy. Like, I just opened up, he came to visit, and I opened up his trunk to put something in his trunk, and then I was just like, why the fuck do you have an NES back here? He was like, yeah, I don't know if I'll ever need it. I was like, what the fuck? <laughs> that's my kind of dude. Yeah, He's Matt, got the right idea, man. Yeah, Matt's a pal. I would totally do that. <clears throat> yeah, we need, like, can't even get past this a part NES, anymore. a Super NES. I think I might have a Super NES. Yeah? Yeah. Nice. I know I at least have some Super NES games, but... Oh, man. So much content. But we can also play games for like PS4 and stuff because I have one of those and he's got an Xbox One. Yeah. Yeah, exactly. So where there's no limit to what we can provide to you now. Before it's pretty much limited to what Steam. games work on your Mac. Yeah, it's what games work on my Mac. Now there's no limits. The sky's the limit. Or the limit is our what consoles we own slash games. But if uh, as far as games go, hey, um. If you have any suggestions, yeah. like, like, comment, subscribe. If you have any suggestions, yeah, like, comment, subscribe, and, uh... Hit us up on Twitter. I was gonna say, you know, you feeling super friendly? You feeling like, uh, you wanna, you wanna see something played on here that we don't necessarily own? If you want to, you could actually send us something, and we will totally play it. Um, and you know what? Fuck! We don't even have to keep mm -hmm. it. If you wanna send something to us, I, I know, sending things to some strangers on the internet, I know, I know it sounds, it sounds strange, but I promise you... If, if you send us something that you want us to play, uh, after we play it, I will send it back to you. I, I don't want to keep your stuff. You will. But I'll borrow it if you want to send it to us, or let us borrow it if you're or somebody we personally you know. it's something we really should play on the show, I mean, we both, we all work. Yeah. So. Well, no, I know, but sometimes, sometimes it's games, you know, that can be hard to find and shit like that, and, you know. We'll play Battletoads. 
Yeah, we're gonna play any, Battletoads. Any version of Battletoads you send us. Yeah, we actually we, have a we version. We have a version of Battletoads. We have a version of Battletoads that will be coming out. That's probably one of the first things we're gonna record when the Elgato gets here. Yeah, I'm not playing that shit. I will. Fuck you. Good. Is How many players is it? Uh, I think it's up to four. Or it might be different because of the version we have. Well, it is Game Boy, so... Yeah, that's what I'm saying. So it might just be one player on that. But oh, man, that game sucks dick. <laughs> it's my version of Battletoads. Mm -hmm. Oof. Which, by the way, we're like total ripoffs of the Teenage Mutant Ninja Turtles. Oh, without a doubt. But, I mean, at the time, that kind of shit was happening a lot. Like, I mean, what about freaking, uh, what was it, Street Sharks or whatever? Street Sharks was amazing. Street Sharks is the shit, but once again, it's all the same shit. Street Sharks, freaking Battletoads, Teenage Mutant Ninja Turtles, it's all the same. Mm, why, why, does, why, why do I... Why am I messing this up? You know what's kind of interesting is uh, the transition that some things uh, make um, before they come to uh, flu uh, fruition. 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 With an R. Fruition. Fruit. Ishin. Fruition. 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 Fruit. Before they come to fruition. Before uh, they get made. <laughs> like, uh, like the fact of like where Teenage Mutant Ninja Turtles started in the comics and stuff like that, as opposed to what they became. Like, you know, they're super cartoony and goofy and stuff like that. The, the super violent Teenage Mutant Ninja yeah, Turtles? Yeah, the original comic was dark. And violent. Yeah, it was dark and violent. It was like Sin City, but with turtles. It was awesome. Speaking of Sin City, I love that movie. Yeah, I haven't seen that movie in a while. Have you ever seen The Spirit, which was also by the two people who did uh, Frank yes, Miller I did. and the other Yes, guy. I did. Frank Miller's awesome. I liked The Spirit a lot. Yeah. I, li I just like comic book movies in general. That's based on a really old comic, though. Yeah. Still, though, you know, it's still one of those things. Like, even, like, The Watchmen, obviously. Like, I mean, like, that, you know, I, I've never got to really... <gasps> Fuck! I never... Damn it. I never really got to read The Watchmen, but, uh... But, I mean, I love the movie. Uh, I... The, the movie's great. The movie is one of, I think, the best comic book movies as far as the source material, except for the com the ending's completely different. Is but it? it's modernized, yeah. I think, because the old ending was very campy. One of my favorite parts is the fact that, um... What is it? Uh, the owl... Save. Night Owl. Yeah, Night Owl, that's it. Um, you can't get it up? No, no, no. Uh, no, when, when Night Owl um, essentially prevents Batman from existing by saving Thomas and Martha Wayne yeah. in the opening. Well, there's some really cool things, um, and I'm going to let this episode go on a little bit longer so I can rant about Watchmen for a bit. Okay. So what happened with Watchmen Don't was... Don't make it too long, though. And we won't. What happened <laughs> with Watchmen was DC had bought up a bunch of characters from Image Comics, um, and because of that, uh, Grant Morrison wanted the rights to them. Uh, but DC realized that he was going to kill off a bunch of the characters at the end of it. Yeah. So they were like, you can't have these characters. So a lot of these characters are based off characters that actually exist in the DC universe. Yes. But he, they couldn't use. So Rorschach is actually based on the question. Yeah. Uh, the, the that, yeah, of course. Night Owl sense. becomes Owl Man that's used in Earth two uh, or 3. Yeah. Uh, so there's a bunch of characters that got bought and never used or not used as much because Grant Morrison was going to kill him so he had to make his own. Yeah. Okay. But, that makes sense. Yeah. That so, totally makes sense. That was uh, my fun fact about Watchmen. So uh, anyway, we'll uh, talk to you next week. Uh, I'll give you I'll give you one more chance. Ready? You got this? Yeah. I think I, I have a good feeling, man. I don't. Well, just like most things in my life, my feelings were wrong. <laughs> and you've been disappointed. Yep. So until next time, this is Artie this and Josh. From Catatonic you. Gaming. I love you. Bye. See you next time, guys. Bye.